going on, Brandon? This is Daniel from Josh and Danny SEO. So we're going to take a quick look at what's going on, see if we can help, and see what we can find. So right off the bat, the only thing I can find for you is your Facebook page, which isn't a bad thing to have. It's always great to go through here as well. It, you know, kind of showing what it is you do. Uh, let's just take a guess and say you install sheetrock as well as painting. Um, I'm going to go as, I mean, as far as that, cause, uh, you, maybe you, you do power washing as well. It's just kind of hard to get an idea of what it is exactly you do without really kind of giving you a call, but let's just go with painting, sheetrock, uh, pressure washing, a lot of things that a general, uh, you know, uh, renovations do as well as painting. Um, but let's take a look. So you do laminate vinyl flooring, interior painting, and exterior painting. Now there is a lot that goes into this stuff. So let's just take a look and see what happens when we uh, kind of delve deeper into this. So this is one way of kind of um, exploring. Uh, if I do click on this, it brings us to more of a Google idea with the GMB or Google My Business profile. Nothing wrong with having this. Uh, you definitely want it. It's just a lot more effective when you do have a website. Um, but looking over everything over here it looks like you're doing all right you got a couple of uh, you know reviews which you're doing fine with um but if i were to look up home renovations but i mean let's check that out let's see where you do appear on the list right so let's do home renovations in houston and find out where it is you fall in the gmb so remember uh gmb and uh what do you call it uh websites are very different so houston remodeling kitchen so let's see, they're about 20 on one or two pages. So let's find out, E and L. All right, so we're already on, there's no more. Showing results one through 20. We're gonna do this last one over here and see if you show up on that one at all. And at the moment, no. Oh, here you are. Uh, this is number, I don't know, uh, 1918. Okay, so you show up at number 18, which is not what you want. You definitely want to be number like one, two, or three. So you're not doing bad on that. At least you have one, but unfortunately, that's really it. Plus, again, if, if I do click on this one, I don't have any website to go to. So let's take a look at what happens when I put in something like this. So this is what we call a keyword. A keyword is what anyone might put into Google to find you. Now, this is something that's very important because it's not only service specific it's also location specific it's somebody looking for a painter in houston now houston is quite big don't get me wrong but we're just going to pick that so you got your google guaranteed over here which i did not mean to click but you know they do pay something for that you got your google ads now when it's location and service specific that's how google ads are created finally yes you can do a gmb optimization and get yourself in here as well oh i spoke to this gentleman a little bit earlier i think his name was tim anyway certa pro a1 prime house painting these guys are the top over here 30 to 40 percent of all clients will click on one of these three guys so it's very important to get in there but then after that you have your organic search this is for websites very important to get in here as well um i noticed you don't have one so i would be talking a little bit more about the advantages of having a website but you got yelp angie's list is number one and two and then we paint houston for don mcdonald painting services now just taking a quick look over here his number is a click to call button so people can immediately get in contact with him without having to open their phone up he's got an about us drop down menu painting services and he talks about all of them and that's excellent you always want to do that he's got testimonials home tips specials latest projects and contact us overall i'm not saying it's a clean website he's still got those borders over here so this was made a little while ago obviously improving homes and businesses since 1981 but he's not doing bad because he's in that top spot over there he has a lot of content, which is exactly what you want, right? He has um, two paragraphs for interior, exterior, power washing. He has got everything he needs on his website. Plus, these are all um, links to other pages. So he's doing an excellent job as far as content goes. Um, layout might be a little bit, you know, like messy, but he's doing an excellent job regardless. But let's take a look. I'm going to show you behind the scenes of how stuff works. So this is something I use. It's called Ahrefs. It's one of the tools that... Uh, helps me search Google Analytics. So right off the bat, a UR rating is how strong a website is, and a DR rating is how much Google trusts you. Now, he is 15 and 1.8. You want these in the 30s and 40s with a ratio of one to one. Now, the way you get these guys up is with backlinks. Now, a backlink is where you have your website link, so wepaintyouston.com, somewhere else where somebody can click on it, and a referring domain is when it returns to you. Now, I'm gonna go on, on a limb here and say that he doesn't have a lot of great referring domains because this would be higher. Now, um, 
not all backlinks are created equal. Some of them are more spammy than others, like BuzzFeed or Wikipedia. Definitely want to stay away from those uh, and get some good, strong painters blogs. Now, he does have 455 different keywords. So 455 different variations of what somebody might put in Google, and he's ranking for those guys. So let's find out what they are. So right off the bat, this is what I typed into Google. He's ranked number five for it, even though he's kind of like number three. 700 people a month searched for it. He's getting 64 of them because he's in position five. When you're in position one, two, and three, you'll typically get anywhere from 10 to 20% of all search volume coming to your website. Now, the cool thing about location and service-specific areas is these are buyer intent keywords. These are people in your area looking to buy now. Painters Houston, Texas, 350 a month. He's getting 41 because he's in position four. Painters Houston, Texas. Everything he's ranking for here is stuff that is local. It's location and service specific to what he is doing. And look at the volume. 700, 350, 350. There's got to be at least four or 5,000 people searching per month for all the stuff he's looking for in Houston. And he's getting a large chunk of each one. A little over 10% 10, 10 for this guy. Less than 10% because he's all the way on, you know, like position eight. So he's barely on page number one. But as you can see, all of it is making a huge difference for him. Metal building painters near me, 70 a month. He's getting 10 because he's in position four. So how does this really help you out? Honestly, GMB is step number one, right? It's good to have that. Step number two is getting a good website. A website is basically like a nice calling card that people can look at and kind of take a, you know, I don't know about calling card, but it's definitely something that they can browse through like a magazine and decide if you're the right person to go with. So step number one is building that. Wouldn't take much because, you know, you have one location, maybe Houston, maybe Spring, maybe, I don't know, wherever it is you want to go in that area. But you go with the website number one, and then finally you got to add content to that. So you saw how he has a lot of content talking about everything he's doing. So content is key. Second is keywords. And then third is we got to get those backlinks going on. So you saw how he has 887 backlinks with 104 referring domains. Good news is just find the ones he's using, use them for yourself, and you can start ranking without any real big deal. Now, obviously, it doesn't take like two minutes. It does take a little bit of time. I'd say about two, three months to start seeing any real results. But other than that, you can just find the good ones from him, add by an additional 30 report, and you should be fine. Well, that's all I got. If you have any questions, please feel free to reach out. Other than that, you have an amazing day. Bye, Brandon.